Basketball is the fifth episode of the first season of The Office. This is directed by Greg Daniels. And as always, there will be spoilers from now as I talk about the episode. And I haven't got too many thoughts, as has been the case with my previous discussions of The Office. I'm not doing a deep analysis. I'm just providing a basic overview and mentioning some personal highlights. And actually, I do have some personal highlights. And I say this because I started watching The Office not exactly enthusiastic but determined to get to the second season because apparently it does get better with the second season but actually slowly I am starting to enjoy the show and I thought basketball despite the fact I don't care for basketball at all was actually not too bad so the main narrative involves the basketball game between the warehouse staff and the office staff and Dwight is also taking over doing the rota for the holiday and weekend staff as corporate now want people to work holidays and weekends. And whoever loses the basketball game has to work holidays and weekends. Doesn't necessarily make the most sense that the loser has to come in on Saturday because they're from different departments. But I guess corporate don't care which department works as long as somebody works, I guess. And the majority of the episode is the, the basketball game. We do have a bit of time spent picking the team. <laughs> Kevin, I don't know why I found this adorable, but when Kevin said, I have a hoop in my driveway, I just found that to be so adorable. And Kevin actually doesn't end up playing basketball. He doesn't get picked for the team. But the team we had, I thought, was pretty interesting. And then we get to see the game being played out. And it's fine. The actual basketball game. As somebody who doesn't care that much for basketball, I knew I wasn't going to completely love that part of it. But actually, the pacing was quite good. It was interesting enough. We have the rest of the office staff who aren't playing actually watching. So we do cut to them occasionally, which helps to make it a little bit more interesting for me. But what I did like was watching Jim and Roy play because Jim basically invited Pamela out at the weekend. Pam and Roy are going away for the weekend. But if Roy's team loses, Roy works in the warehouse, then he'd have to work. So Pamela would be free at the weekend and Jim is going to a, a, an outlet store and basically invited her to go along with him. So whether or not that's going to happen, she didn't exactly agree to that because she said, it doesn't matter, Roy's team is going to win and we're going away. Jim is trying really hard to win because he wants Roy to work at the weekend. And I, I thought that was quite interesting and I quite enjoyed that part of the basketball game. The rest of the game, I didn't really care for, but that's a personal preference thing. It has nothing to do with the quality of the episode. And I thought it was it was pretty entertaining. And I, I didn't mind it. And as I said, I kind of, I feel like I am starting to enjoy the show now, which is a, a good sign since things apparently do get better from the next season. So I'm looking forward to that. One more episode to go. And I also enjoyed Kevin shooting hoops at the end of the basketball game, basically proving that actually he should have been on the team. And, and I rather like that. And I also like the fact that Michael didn't make them work the next day instead and I thought that was that was that was quite nice of him even though it's what corporate wants he knows that it's not going to help with morale even though his passing comment that working Saturday won't make a difference to the almost guaranteed layoffs wasn't the best for morale but I, I think his, his heart was in the right place nevertheless and I enjoyed the episode a lot more than I expected based on the fact that I don't care for basketball so I'm looking forward to watching the last episode, mostly because I'm looking forward to watching season two and seeing what the changes are like. But for now, I'm pleased to say I thought basketball was a pretty decent episode and I'm keen to see what's in store for the final episode of the first season of The Office. <laughs> 